Give it up for James Dobra. of the heart that could cause permanent scarring. In other words, just looking at you gives me a heart attack. Heartbreak. I will not be able to post that joke on YouTube. I do have a YouTube channel. You're not funny. You are okay. Not funny. There's my plug. You're welcome. Well, so many things you can't put online now, but I, I, of course, I'm just like every comic here trying to be insta-famous on Instagram. You learn so much. You learn about conspiracy theories. Most of them, six months later, you find out to be true. Some you learn from years past were completely false, like beer goggles. It was once assumed that a male, usually, would get so intoxicated he would perceive a female to be very attractive and then find out the next morning, not so much. Well, now we've learned that's maybe not the case because all it took was a wipe, wipe, wipe it down, ten. One was actually a two before. So maybe, just maybe, went back to the house and the pillowcase wiped, wiped. All the copious amount of makeup off the face. And the true colors are shining through. I see your true colors, and I find you ugly, and I'm now afraid that we're going to have really ugly children. Other things I've learned, usually it's from my teenager, who's got a new word like every day. He came home from work the other day, he's like, Dad, I finally got that tea on a coworker. Oh my gosh, you teabag somebody at work? That's so bad. No! What? What? What is that? What is teabag? Disregard, tell me about this tea thing. I found out why a coworker got fired. Oh, the gossip, the gossip. Why didn't you just say that? Where did these words come from? The tea? From a whole bunch of ladies sitting around talking smack about each other. Oh, that Bethel. I can't believe she said slash did slash wore that. She is such a skank. I don't know if old ladies say skank. I'm, I don't. Go to old lady tea parties, I'm just assuming, okay? Uh, another one is, Dad, I made over $300 this week. No cap. Of course there's no cap. You can make as much money as you want, son. Just push through, work a couple extra hours. He goes, no, Dad, I'm just not exaggerating. I'm not lying. Gosh. I'm like, why didn't you just say literally? You literally say literally when it's not literally literal. <laughs> all the time. Oh, and my personal favorite, one day he comes home and he goes, Dad, I got that drip. Oh, goodness. We need to go to the clinic right now. And we cannot tell your mother. He goes, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? I'm, I got new jewelry. Oh, you got bling. Why didn't you just say that you're black? You can just say bling bling, you can get away with it. I can't, but you can't, son. You can, my little half and half African. <laughs> and he's like, but what were you talking about with this, the drip thing? Oh, when I hear drip, it's something completely different. I thought you and the tea bag girl. No, never mind, never mind, never mind. All right, that's my time, have a good one. James Dover, everybody.